Hey guys, it's Victoria. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be recreating Ariana Grande's makeup look from her amazing new music video, Seven Rings. Her new music video is amazing and I really wanted to create a makeup look from this video. There is a bunch that I could have done, but I'm going to do this one. I'll put it on the screen here. The going off of that photo as well as a bunch of screenshots that I took during the music video. So I already put on my foundation and I did my eyebrows and some concealer and that's it. So we have a lot left to do. So let's get started. So first I want to finish off my face and in this video, um, it definitely looks like Ariana has a deeper contour, so I'm going to apply a lot of bronzer. So I'm using the Tarte Park Avenue Princess palette, and I'm going to go into the shade angle and really deepen up my face. I'm going to be contouring my nose. And now this contour is super harsh. I'm going to use some Laura Mercier translucent powder, and I'm going to just clean up contour because it's way too dark. Once all of this powder is on, I'm just going to dust it off. So now I'm going to mix the shade Princess Cut, which is a little bit of a lighter bronzer, along with the shade Enhance, and just mix those two together so I get a little bit of a lighter shade, and I'm just going to bring this contour up a little bit. I'm going to tap it out with my Beauty Blender, just bringing it up and sort of blending it out a little bit. Although you can't see if Ariana has on any blush in this photo, um, I'm going to just add a little bit of this Kylie Cosmetics Winter Kiss Pressed Blush Powder and I'm going to just apply this just to add a little bit more color to my face. Now in this photo she also has on a lot of highlighter so I'm going to use the Fenty Beauty Matchstick Highlighter and I'm just going to lightly tap this on my skin and then I'm going to also apply a loose highlighter over top. So now I'm using the Wet n Wild Loose Highlighting Powder and this is in the shade I'm So Lit and I'm just using what's, whatever's in the cap and going to just apply so much of this. Over top of that I'm using the Kylie Cosmetics Loose Powder Highlight in the shade Santorini to really make this highlight even more blinding. Now we can move on to the eyes. So the eyes for this look are kind of intricate and complicated and it's not that easy to see in the photo. But I'm going to just go for it anyway and see how it turns out. Lay down a little bit of shadow onto my lids. You can use any sort of neutral and matte shadows. I'm using the Smashbox Matte Cover Shot Eye Palette. I'm going to just, I'm going to just start out by laying down this light matte shade over my lids. Now I'm just going to add a little bit of the next darkest shade here. I'm applying this to my crease right here, especially the inner half of my crease because I don't know if it's just the shadow or if she actually has eyeshadow here. And I'm applying a little bit just to this outer corner here to add a little bit more dimension. And then I'm also just adding some of this color to my lower lash line. Now that that is done, I'm going to go in with a NYX Gray Eye Pencil and I'm going to just try and follow this photo that I have here. So I'm going to start out by just creating my wings liner. And just so that it's not as permanent, I'm going to also do the design that she has in her crease using this pencil and then I'll go over it with some black liquid liner. Silver eyeliner from Tarte and I'm going to just sort of use some silver on the outside here because that's where Ariana has hers as well. And that's what I'm going to do for the silver for now, just this little section, and then I'm going to come back to it later. I'm going in with a black liquid eyeliner from NYX, and I'm going to draw on the black design here. This starts from the 
in our corner crease. And this black design doesn't go out as far as the gray. So it sort of goes sh like, it's like a squiggle, but it's generally straight. So it's not on a slant or anything. I'm just going to repeat the exact same thing on the other eye. Okay, so now that the black in the crease is done, I'm going to use that gray pencil again and just fill in this area. I'm going back in with my liquid liner and just cleaning up whatever just got covered up. Ariana also has sort of like a cat eye on her inner corner. I'm just going to also add that. Using a black eye pencil and just lining my waterline. I'm using some matte black shadow and applying this to my lower lash line. I'm also going to take some of this black shadow and very lightly go over the gray liner because in the photo it really looks almost black but it's not exactly Now I'm going back in with the silver liquid liner and I'm just going to fill in this space right here. So again, add a little bit of matte black shadow right over top of the silver. Make it just a little bit deeper because this is a little bit, it's a little bit of a brighter silver than I want. And I'm using a NYX liquid crystal silver body glitter and I'm just going to go over silver like also adding a line of silver glitter on top of the black in my crease putting this towards my inner corners now i'm just going to apply my ardell lashes so ariana also has on a really dark lip it almost looks black so i'm using another gray pencil from nyx and i'm just going to line my lips and then i'm using the NYX Liquid Suede Lipstick in the shade Stone Fox and I'm just going to apply this. So to finish up this look, all I did was apply some silver glitter to my lips and I put my hair up in a half a half down, the wrap around the ponytail, and I put on a tank top like Ariana had on in the music video with like kind of the same, kind of the same neckline. So this is the finished look. That's it for today's video. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hit the bell button when you subscribe and start next to it to turn on my post notifications so you're notified when I upload every single new video. I upload a new video every week, so be sure to go check out last week's video. So this look actually kind of took a while to do, so I really hope you guys liked it and maybe tag Ariana Grande, even though I doubt she'll ever see this. Um, but yeah, so you guys can also find me on Instagram, Facebook, and Snapchat at Victoria Costanz and on Twitter at Vic Costanz, so be sure to go follow me on there. And let me know if you guys like these kinds of videos with me using inspiration from music videos and more celebrities and stuff. Um, this makeup look is definitely very different and a lot darker than anything I've ever worn. So let me know what you guys thought of the music video, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye!